Well, here's our stock in focus. We're looking at Infinity uh, Pharmaceuticals, and what we're seeing here is a stock that had a very nice run here. You could see a very big, big run, uh, very dramatic. And the thing is, is that you got to realize here is you start to see this really change. You could see a very dramatic move over the week, and. I think what's always hard to you know hard to really know is you know when uh, you know when is it okay just to buy the dip because that's what everybody starts to think oh hey I missed this move I want to buy the dip it makes perfect sense to do so where you start to really I think start to see a major change is that the best kind of way to do it is I think to divide and conquer here now you know you have the uh, you know the retracement range from the high to the low so you know that that should be the midpoint it should hold that and the fact it didn't really would have made sure that you missed this move entirely because after it started to break down lower even lower than the 61 uh, um, uh, percent retracement um, on the Fibonacci because uh, that's the extent on that if once you break that range that really is a pretty big warning sign now you could see how it tries to get back into the 30 and can't break over the 50-day moving average on the daily you see close back under and not able to break over that or the 50-day moving average this was a warning sign here you see it's still not quite done with its sell-off but what also is a very big warning sign is this this is look at the big bars that you have here you're losing really from 50 almost a 50 10 point swing from from this range so almost like an easy eight point swing right here but a total of at least in the two day move of 10 points you see it recover okay and then you see another dramatic day so you're seeing it open up at 44 and a half hitting a low of 37 you know an easy uh, seven point move to the downside and then you see it again another day opens up at 38 hits the low of, of 